So before I get into the video, all credit goes to Click Taser. I do not own any of the content shown in this video, but I was given permission to use it. Thank you and enjoy the video. Hey guys, it's your boy GameBG on YT and welcome back to another amazing video where today we're going to be a new series for the best of YouTube and what a better way to kick it off than my favorite commentary channel. Combat Wombat. The 20 year old male has two YouTube channels, one named Click Taser holding over 9,000 subscribers and his main channel Combat Wombat with over 100,000 subscribers. He just reached that the other day. I'm very proud of him. He also has a Twitter account and an active Discord channel. And he does all of this while running a separate job and having time for his beautiful fiance as well. All of those things I'll never be able to do. But moving on. Recently, Taser was demonetized for bullying and harassment. And I heard about this, and that kind of triggered some thoughts about going up to the man and calling him out for it. But then I watched his channel and saw he had millions of views. Now how would that be possible if he was bad? Let's get into it. This is the meaning of harassment. And after looking into his channel, he isn't using it to threaten anyone. He is simply using this as a series to entertain his fans that love and respect him a lot. Let's take a look. Well, as is expected, when you make controversial videos like that, you're going to have some criticism in the comments section. Hell. Someone even made two videos criticizing my video. OOF! As always, when this happens, I address these comments in a video to clear things up and for simple entertainment. I also feel like I need to explain myself a little bit for people new to my channel. People think I'm being toxic here and that I hate everyone I make a video on. This is a comedy commentary channel, focused on criticizing YouTubers, and I'm also trying to branch out into video game commentaries. That's not everyone's cup of tea? Fine, I get that. But understand what you're getting into here. I'm here to criticize content, games, really stupid articles on games, and joke around in the process. With that being said, there's a few things I want to say about Taser. People say that Taser is jealous of the people he targets. Let me tell you, I'd most definitely be jealous of someone with 2 million subs with the same view count of my 100,000 sub channel. See the sense in that? Taser isn't jealous, so just shut up. Next point, the man has a family he has to attend to, all while making videos for two channels, running a Discord channel, and talking with his fans constantly. Jesus Christ, do you get any sleep, Taser? That's amazing. And before making a video, Taser makes sure he has facts of the people used in them, like Sernando, for example. Let's look at that as well, shall we? Even I could act better than you. You don't even try. Although, I suppose you don't have to act to get your views and subs. Seeing as all 2.4 million of your subscribers are 12 year olds who you tricked into thinking were entering a giveaway for a PS4. Hey guys, my name is Fernando. Welcome back, welcome back. Before I get started with all the crazy BS that's going on right now in this video. No, don't tell me. You're gonna plug a fake giveaway here that says you'll win a free PS4 for liking and subscribing because you don't have the talent to get subscribers any other way. I wanna let you guys know that we're still hosting the PS4 giveaway. Damn, I must be fucking psychic. If you guys don't know, I'm gonna be giving away a free PlayStation 4 and three Amazon gift cards where you guys can go ahead and purchase whatever you want. So all you need to go ahead and do is- No, 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 let me finish it for you. Like and subscribe and I'll magically know who you are and pick a winner. I'll even know your address right away. Simply drop a like on this video and subscribe to my channel. And that's pretty much it guys. All you need to do is just drop a like, subscribe to my channel, and lastly leave a random comment down below telling me you want a PS4 where I can actually enter your name down. You can even spam down below in the comment section as many comments as you want. It just increases your chances of me choosing you. More like it raises the number of comments on your video and makes it look good to YouTube, therefore raising you on the search engine. If you put that into thought, Sernando got popular the wrong way by leeching kids. That's one of the many examples I could use. Now, with the last thing I'm going to do is his relationship with his fans. There is one thing that sets Taser apart from any other YouTuber. Hate comment or not, 
he will heart your comment and sometimes even reply. Then you go to his Discord, where you can see him take his job seriously. Don't believe me? Go look yourself. That, and even his fiance, says he's a great guy. I had a chance to talk with Elaine for the past couple of days, and she's sweeter than a peach and who is also wild at times. But who isn't? I've heard instance they've talked to each other and they really love each other. I can respect a man that treats his family with as much respect as he does his fans. So despite being bad to you, there's something that everyone that don't like him can do. Not watch. But in my honest opinion, I recommend you guys do. I'll link his information in the description, but as I wrap this up, there's one last thing I want to say. Taser, if you're watching this, no, you inspire a lot, and I love you so much. No homo, of course. Keep up the good work, and keep respecting your fans, and we'll keep respecting you. But for now, I'm gonna get going. I thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the video. And go give Combat Wombat some love. Tell him that the BG of YT sent you. Anyways, that's all. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.